This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, and let YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the video that I put them out. See, I'm thinking it's him analyzing that data, but like I tell y'all every day, the data they release us is false, when it gives a false narrative to markets, we can make bad trade decisions. Listen, Tesla stock has been moving lately, but, and we know the technology that 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 Elon Musk puts in a Tesla that makes it such a great company. But one of the things that people don't talk about is the Hydra Gigapress. Okay? And what the Hydra Gigapress does is it reduced the cost of manufacturing a car by about 40%. Because instead of using robots to make this part, that part, and that part, and then put them all together. The iDrug Gigapress allows a car manufacturer to mold like a major part of the car in one shot. So that just reduces the cost of manufacturing a car. And that's one of the main components of how Tesla has been manufacturing the Tesla cars by using the iDrug Gigapress to kind of mold a majority of the frame of the car, therefore reducing the cost. But the reason I bring that up today is this. Costs have been going up all around the market. Toyota, Ford, uh, Nissan, whatever. A majority of these car manufacturers, their costs have been going up. So now these, these car manufacturers are actually contacting Hydra Gigapress and they are going to start using Ida, Hydra Gigapress to help them reduce their cost in manufacturing their cars. So in the near future, Toyota, Ford, Nissan, and probably a host of other brands are going to be using the Hydra Gigapress in order to reduce the cost of manufacturing their cars by 40%. Now, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell Hydra Gigapress. I'm just telling you that maybe it's something that you might want to keep on your radar. Right now, Hydra Gigapress is owned 30% by San Paola Bank and another 70% by LK Machinery, which is traded on the Hong Kong Stock Exchange. And I guess if you want to invest in that company, you could get on the Hong Kong, Hong Kong Stock Exchange and buy some shares in that company. The only purpose of this video is not to buy, hold, or sell. It's just to inform you that a lot of car manufacturers are going to be using the Hydra Gigapress process in the future to reduce their costs. And because of that, it might be a good idea to hold Hydra Gigapress on your stock watch list as a company to watch. Anyway, have a great, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that Hydra Gigapress has the potential to really move up because more major manufacturers are going to start using that process? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.